Hey, what's happening? It's Ryan Cavino with Northeast Realty Partners and RyanCavinoRealEstate.com bringing you the multifamily um, new, reactivated, price change, sold, expired for the uh, week ending August 4th, 2010. And we'll have a few properties this week. And uh, we have a new one on Irving Street, which is a complete unique property. It is a six unit building that uh, is not really. Summer set up at studios, and uh, let's take a look. It's a six unit home with a detached laundromat. So it's not something that is um, too normal for what we're seeing out there, but I wonder what the property, if they let us know for what the, it makes at the, the laundry studio. But the net income is 62,900 bucks from this place. So let's just take that one out because most multifamilies are meant for two and three families. So we have uh, 16 Hancock Court, which is a three family plus a finished garage. And this one's for $599. It went on and came off very quickly. It was on for 274 days and now it came back. So maybe they didn't get financing or the financing was difficult for that type of property. And this Tontine Street's been on a while. Um, down to 305, which is really uh, a decent deal. I wonder how the layout for this place would be. And lastly, it is a short sale. So that's probably why it's taken some time. But the sold that went under is William, uh, Myrtle, and Yale Street. And William Street is a property that came on the market for $299.9. And it sold for $371. Uh, it is, where is this located? That goes to tell you, man. Two, uh, the two families in, in Medford, 371 is a, is a great price for it. This is near, let's see how close it is to Tufts. It's actually closer to Somerville on the Somerville line because Tufts is way over here, up here, where most of the campus is. So. So basically, the multifamilies for this week is the average is 452 and been on the market for 177 days, and the, the, the ones that are selling are selling quickly when they're priced. Look at that. 440, 345, and 371. So that's an average uh, price. Um, I think it's a little bit more than 356 because that's the average list price. If you took that, that'd probably be in the uh, 375, 380 range, and that's uh, you know probably where the market for Memphis should be. So... That is the multifamily update for August 4th. Have any questions? Ryan at RyanCavino.com or 978-835-6870.